When I first read Bad Blood, I think I was really excited by the possibility of working on something that I had never tackled before, and so I'm always fascinated and excited by films that represent something new and different for me and something that I haven't had the chance to, to work on, so it's certainly new territory for me. The idea that you could play two people in one film is just not an opportunity that comes up very often. I think Bad Blood is about a writer whose past is coming back to haunt him and he's grief-stricken and trying to move on and he meets this young woman, Carrie, who is kind of like a light in, in his life and then, and then it kind of all goes a bit pear-shaped. <laughs> the biggest challenge is trying to find a motivation for Gilroy that wasn't just crazy and maniacal and evil for the sake of evil. It was, you know, I suppose he's kind of defined by his envy and his self-loathing and the fact that he's forgotten, you know, and it kind of generates this kind of spite and hatred and whereas Vincent on the other hand is, you know, a kind of, he's sort of this golden boy who's had a very blessed life and aside from the, the and until the tragedy of his wife's death has kind of pushed him into a place that's really dark as well. So they're actually both in kind of dark places, but for different reasons. And yeah, so there's all sorts of crazy stuff going on. <laughs> oh, Morgan's great. She's such a wonderful actor and really lovely person too. And so we've worked together a couple of times and we have now have a great shorthand and are very good friends. When you already know and have worked with, with someone, then it's just a much more efficient process and you don't sort of have to kind of beat around the bush and like, hey, do you, how do you feel about rehearsing? And you know, some people, some actors don't like rehearsing and don't like even talking about it. So you sort of end up trying to figure it out on the day. But I think because we were moving so quickly on this film, uh, it, was, it was just a necessity to, to meet in the evenings and kind of go over uh, and just sort of not even rehearse, but just clarify, just to sort of be on the same page about where this would or wouldn't go or could go. I think Morgan is, she's such a charismatic person and I think that really comes across on screen. Like anyone who's ever met and worked with her will, will tell you that she's just so lovely and, and smart and she really cares about film. And so I think all those qualities contribute to a really compelling performance. So I'm lucky to work with her.